Hello. Welcome back to Inventor Expert reacts to other people's tutorials. Or maybe as I should have called it. Mate, my name's Neil Cross. Cross examination. How is that for a name for a series? Cross examination of other people's event. Running with that. That's it. Cross examination. So, yeah, thanks to everyone who supported the series so far. I'm out in Australia at the moment. That's why I'm pumping out a few of these videos. If you live in Australia, then you're near Sydney. It's a big place. But I'm in Australia for uh, the Australian Manufacturing Week in Darling Harbour. I'll be on the Cross Technology Group booth in AM74, Halls 1 and 2. So come and say hello. But whilst I'm out there, mate, let us know what you think of this series by heading down there, ladies, and hitting the like button. Uh, uh, let us know in the comments as well if there's any other tutorials or channels you want me to take a look at. So, let's take a look at what's on offer today. Uh, first, I suppose, uh, as tradition would have it. <laughs> it's not really a tradition, but... Oh, that's still not a good idea. What, what does YouTube think I I'd be interested in on the trending page? <laughs> this absolute garbage. I made tourists think they landed at the wrong airport. 1.4 million views in a day. Well, mate, aren't you a stand-up product of the British education system, cretin? Some guy writing, welcome to Luton next to Gatwick Airport, making tourists think they landed at the wrong airport. Mate, you've got a bright future ahead of you when your viewers have been the... They all grow up. What are you going to do? What are you going to put your CV after this, mate? Uh, young Philly eats... Oh, I, I can't do this. I, I can't. Right, let's take a look at what's on offer on the tutorial scene. I don't know. We're just going to pick something. Not at random, but we'll... Or desk tutorial in that... Or backwards. Well, let's really throw it. Right, we'll, we'll do filters this month. Oh, look, ma'am. Ah, I'm famous. I'm right at the top world. Our SEO's putting in the work for me there, right? I can't, how are you doing that? 16,000 views in two weeks. Turn the foot. 16 comments from 16,000. Uh, nah, I call f f free on that, like. Nah, nah, nah. I'm not having it. I covered those guys in my first video. Nah, there's, there's some fuckery going on with that. The, the, the cursory cannot be contained when it comes to those lot. Well, there's a channel name. 3D Parametric Solid Model Drawing. I recognize this name. I believe these guys are possibly, they were around maybe when I started my channel. Let's take a look at what these guys have got to offer. So let's maximize this. So we've got Nishith Srivi, I'm not gonna be able to pronounce that. Uh, looks like Indian or from another country of the same sort of geography. But, mate, no, you can't, you can't be using those badges, right? Okay, whoa, 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 time out, time out, time out, time out, time out. Autodesk Inventor 2012 Certified Associate. Autodesk Inventor 2012 Certified Professional. You can paste your, you can paste your license number there, mate, all you want. It means f all. These badges and these certifications and these credentials expire three years after you sit the exam, mate. You made this video in 2022. These exams expired seven years ago. You can't flaunt yourself as a certified professional seven years after your, your exam expired. You can't do that. I mean, no one's going to come after you because, you, I mean, I, I don't know what you signed up. I don't know what we signed up to when we took the exam, but you can't do that. The badge expired. So you, you are not a certified professional. You are not a certified associate. In fact, back in the day, you used to have a database called the Certified Professional Search where you could go and look up somebody's name and it'll tell you and like validate that they actually passed the exam when they passed the exam and it'll tell you some information about them. So you could, I could search his name and verify that he's not actually a certified professional. Unfortunately, I think GDPR possibly put a stop to that. So I don't think we can do that anymore. But the fact that in 2022, he's showing a 2012 badge. Oh, mate, come on. What's this mu- <laughs> what's this music? What's this- is this from like a 1990s fax machine sales conference? Where do you get this music from? This is horrendous. What's this background as well? And this text, yellow on purple. Mate, you've been doing- I'm pretty sure you guys have been around for a long time. I, I definitely recognize this channel name. Let's do oldest, sort by oldest. Nine, nine years, come on, mate, in nine years. I mean, I, I've got issues with my videos, right? I'm still messing about with color grading and camera angles and audio and stuff. But after nine years, your, your graphics should not look like that. Let's be honest. <laughs> let's, let's be real. You should be, you should be getting a handle on that. You should definitely not. In fact, hang on a minute. Something's, let's take a look at your very first inventor video. Something's... Not quite. You're using this. You're using the same pictures. 
<laughs> Mate, move on. Come on. 2013, 2022. Mate, that is just the epitome of laziness. <laughs> and it's, I mean, at least, have you changed the font? I don't know. But, like, the pictures are in the exact same spot. Look at that. Just control. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> nine years ago nine years ago today nine years ago today oh mate that's that's hilarious anyway <laughs> back to the back to the point oh this music's is this horrendous i i would turn off straight away i can't, I can't, I can't do this I can't, i've got to do this right come on let's go Who's put this together? What program even exists that makes like graphics with like a cube spin like that? I mean, granted, that's a pretty decent looking mechanism. It's not, it's not difficult to do. Like if, if if anyone knows anything about Inventor, but you know, I guess someone coming in from from fresh would be like, "Oh, that looks really impressive." This guy obviously knows what he's doing. If they can if they can stomach the music, but the tutorial itself, four cylinder engine assembly, or doesn't invent a tutorial. Dear viewers, today we invented 2018. It's 2022, mate. Why are you showing 2000? If if this was like two years ago. This version of Inventor would be off of the support list. It would be obsolete. Like you're borderline, borderline off of the support list at this point. Who do you think is on Inventor 2018 at this point? Oh, come on. I mean, it's a stretch to call that an engine. I mean, that's like four bits of an engine. My audio, the speaker's gone off. Oh, f off, man. Oh, this is another silent tutorial, isn't it? Oh. No! Can't do it. Not having it. Not doing it. Not doing it. No, no, no. You've got the ability to put music into your introduction to make a cube spin graphic, but you you, you can't be asked to record yourself talk. Nah, nah, I'm not, I'm not having it. You're using a five-year-old version of Inventor. What, what are you doing? S just stop. Stop. Stop making videos. Is, is your license even legit? Because you're not even signed in. The, the, I have questions. Don't be... You, you, no! You, you, can't, you can't expect people to read the bottom of your screen and follow what you're doing at the same time. That's not how tutorials work. You, you're not a special snowflake. Just no. I'm so triggered. I'm so triggered. <laughs> Oh, no, I'm not, I can't do this. I'm, I can't do this. Let's take a look at what else they've got. Hang on a minute. The YouTube channel of 3D Parameters on your You motherfuckers speak English as well. So why are, you, why are you doing silent tutorials? Just stop. Stop immediately and go do something else with your time. Stop wasting server space on YouTube. What's two minutes? You don't want two minutes and fifty. Well, let's take, all right, let's take a look at this. Right, let's take a look I at what. I think whatever. we should explore. Right really really upset that i'm watching one of their ads i'm not gonna lie hello viewers welcome back to our why are you talking in this one and not the other ones our youtube channel 3d parametric solid model drawing you've got good english actually it's grand you've got a strong accent it doesn't matter though you if you speak you speak good english i understand what you're saying don't make silent tutorials they are the plague of youtube Nobody wants to watch a silent tutorial. You cannot teach if you're not speaking. <laughs> and stop using these badges as well, you cretin. I'm not certified. I said it in my last video. With the fact the first tutorial video I said I used to be a certified professional of nine years until I stopped taking the exam. But my badge is now expired. I cannot put that badge on any of my videos now. Because and I don't. It does, it's expired. There we go. Right. So I've just logged into my Credly account, which is where it stores the, the, the badges. This badge was issued to me on November 15, 2016. Expired November 15, 2019. They're a three-year issue. After 2019, I just thought I can't be asked to take this anymore. It's pointless. I don't the, the exam doesn't mean anything to me. It, I don't like the new exams. But now that I'm no longer certified, my badge is expired. I can't use this badge on any of my videos or any of my social media platforms. 
because I'm not certified anymore. So neither are you when it expired seven years ago. In this video, we will create a simple sketch by activating the line tool. You can also create an arc with the help of this tool. So let's start. It is all. Is this, is this just let's draw a line? Is it, did he just point at the, did he just copy paste the inventor help articles from the inventor website? Lazy, the laziness is just off the charts. Our design window of the Autodesk inventor. At first, the still on in 2018, still not signed in. I have questions about the legitimacy of these licenses. When you will like. open the software, <laughs> you will go to the sketch panel and activate. <laughs> you will go to it. The start to the sketch command. First of all, it will ask you that who plane you want to start the sketching. Okay, on here we have already selected. Clearly, I'm not in the right frame of mind to be doing this. I'm so triggered. Nothing good is going to come of this. It doesn't matter how good it is. X, Y, P. I don't think it's going to be good anyway. So now we will activate the line tool from here. You can see the tool tip of this tool so that you can understand that how it works. You can see the tooltip so you can understand how it works. <laughs> I know what you're here for. <laughs> Teach people how it works. I can't do it. Uh, I can't be bothered. Don't know how. But if you want to, if you're interested in learning something, because uh, I'm not going to do that bit, just read the f***ing tooltip. <laughs> I'll do my job for me. <laughs> if you want to know more detailed information about this tool, oh, you, you can, can go, go back to the website where we copy and pasted, snagged the, the first picture from. You can go there as well. Help just learn. Section. Don't bother with my tutorials. Just go to inventors help pages. Okay. <laughs> it is oh the center God. origin part of the file. So start the line tool from this point. Create a vertical line doing? like this. Drag the line right side direction. How did you, how did you do that? And I <laughs> and click on this point. Now you can also. Uh, you've just you've just dragged the tangent arc out from the end of the line, but you haven't said how you've did that. Create a vertical line like this. Drag the yeah. line right side direction. Drag the line right side. Well, how? You, 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 what? And click on this point. Now you ah. can also create an arc by using the line tool without activating the arc tool. The two D oh. line segments and arcs are individual curves. A coincident constraint joins their endpoints. Where? When you move, where's the coincident constraints? Why do you think anyone who's listening to you knows what you're talking about? What's a coincident constraint? Where is it? What are you talking about? What does it mean? And what does it do? Just saying it doesn't mean diddly squat to anyone listening a to you. you can't, <laughs> this is not a tutorial. Take it out of the title immediately. Delete the video. All joint segments and arcs also move. Okay, all right. Now create one more vertical and horizontal line to complete the sketch profile. Just create a horizontal line and a vertical line and you'll be fine. Just, <laughs> there you go. Now you know how to draw a line. Uh, that is, there's my tutorial. <laughs> oh, oh, give me strength. Now we will make a rectangle. No, no more. <laughs> no in the more. following way with the help of this tool. Why are you doing two skills? Why are you drawing a rectangle with lines? What What is the purpose of this? What is that? I mean? will tell in my next video how to make these sketches fully constrained with the help of the dimension tool. So viewers, you saw in this video how nothing. easily such sketch profiles can be made with I the didn't. help of the line tool. No. I hope that you will definitely like this video. Definitely if you didn't. may like this video, Please nope. like and subscribe to my channel as no, well as please share this video with your friends and <laughs> with my friends. <laughs> share it with my friends. Oh, yeah, yeah, my friend who's like, a, I don't know, a nurse or a head teacher. Just, you know, here it is. Watch it. Why? I, I don't, I don't, I don't use a uh, card or inventor. It doesn't matter. The guy asked me to share it with you. So uh, fancy watching it. No, I don't want to watch it. Fucking please. watch it. <laughs> So now we will meet you in our next video. Okay, friends. Uh, goodbye. You're not my friend. That was, I'd, I'd be very surprised if I ever come across a channel as bad as this again. What have I just been subjected to? <laughs> what have I just watched? Like if after nine years, you can't be asked to even update your introductory graphics. You, who knows if you can even be asked to keep up to date with the software. What a bizarre exchange. Sir, how, how long your series will go? I mean, for how many months?
I've created several videos in an Autodesk Inventor, but I think that I should create some short videos related to in Inventor software. So I am creating smiley face. Okay, thanks, sir. Uh, what a bizarre exchange. It just makes me so... M anyway, there you go. That is uh, 3D parametric solid model drawing. Really trying to nail the SEO on YouTube and, and get the get all the search hits for anyone searching for anything to do with CAD. Hey, what's this shite at the top? We are wholeheartedly dependent on the mercy of Almighty God. De dependent? What do you mean you're dependent on the mercy of Almighty God? What the, what the f*** does that even mean in context of a CAD tutorial? Dependent on him for what? It's the, a, a license? A, oh, stop. Just stop. Ah, uh, I need to. I need to end this. Right. Anyway, that's that's, that's enough of that. I've got to, I can't. I can't do this anymore. Let's hope we never have to come across them again. Uh, can Can I block them from the search results? I don't think I can. I was... Mate, dodge them at all costs. Not worth the server space the videos are stored on. But as part of the series, that's the point. We'll look for crap. We'll flush it out, and we'll find some good stuff as we're going along. Uh, I'm a bit of a giggle as we're going through. Oh, we'll get triggered. Who knows? Eric Beaton, my name's been Neil Cross. This is Tech 3D. That's been a good cross-examination of uh, of the evidence on display. Uh, that didn't sound very uh, much like legally as I told it. Or barrister QC speak. Doesn't matter. It's not important. Thanks for watching. If you did like this one, hit the like button. Uh, drop us your channels and video uh, sub uh, suggestions in the comments down below if you've got anything that you want us to take a look at in particular. And I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Doodles!